It is definitely nerve-wracking when you're stepping out on the stages. I've been doing it since the age of 12. But once I got a taste of it, I knew this is what I wanted to do. I get overwhelmed in my mind. Well, 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 would you look at that? Another person telling me that I should just relax. Calm down and take it easy, everything will be okay. My friends tend to say a lot that I, I you know, I'm determined. I've had many setbacks. I've been on world tours, and then I've had to go work a furniture delivery job. You remember the pandemic, that thing that happened, you know? I hate when people talk about it, but it's kind of like the pivotal moment for me. Every day, from March until August, I posted like a cover on TikTok, and it just didn't work. I was like, I must be horrendous, nobody likes me. My girlfriend sits me down and is like, I think you need to get a job, you have no money. She kind of gives me this, motivational talk you can do this you just need to you know put up your own music I mean she was like when I come home from work you better have something to show me which sounds harsh but in hindsight it was the best thing that ever happened to me usually I have like voice memos on my phone Feels like I'm somebody else. this is the verse this is the chorus and so I was like this weird melody but I've none what am I gonna sing about and I made the beat and then it just came out of me it was almost like it was just sent down like from above and then my girlfriend came home and she was like, well, what have we got? And I just pressed play and stared out the window because I was like, she's going to hate this. And she was like, that's the best song you've written. And I was like, you messing? I'm broke as shit and I'm downright fucking sick and tired of it. That video just, just skyrocketed, you know, and it changed everything for me. I hate to keep talking about pandemic, but, you know, that was kind of the moment where everything kind of changed for me. I started producing music in this bedroom here, sitting at the edge of my bed with busted up Beats headphones. It was a whole journey of learning stuff, teaching how to do all these bits and putting them out into the world as they were intended. You know, and it all just kind of feels like, you know, I was meant to be here. The law of attraction and the law of visualization and manifestation, you know, those things, I think I was lacking for quite a while and I was just kind of beating the drum and, you know, running into these walls and trying to just break through. You become more content when you believe that everything is happening for a reason. Oh, did you like that? I saved it. Where that would have broke me before, it's kind of now, okay, well that happened for a reason. This place is the wonderful Curra of Kildare, literally two minutes from my house. A lot of the time for me, you know, you can get stressed and anxious over songs not doing well and whether you're doing the right thing and the busyness of life. Real world is a big thing for me and I think people can do that a lot more. When all this is here, you know, why does it matter what someone thinks about you on online? People tend to be on their phones a lot, which is good, but come out here into the real world, touch the grass. Hey, you! Come closer. Closer! Right there! You're amazing. I suppose there's like, I mean, a lot of ups and downs that come with music in general or, or any sort of art and putting your creative work out there, you know? But I think it's good to have people around you that you love being around. And that's kind of like how I, how I ground myself that, you know, all the other stuff, it doesn't matter because you've got, you've got a good solid group of supporters and friend group and whatever. And then of course, just kind of general day to day, you know, is this good enough, you know? It kind of creeps in every now and then. We're only human anyway, you know? So it's about kind of just remembering you're only human, whether you're at the highest of the highs or you're at the lowest of the lows, we're all the same and it's not, you know, it doesn't make anyone different. I can't be anybody else because I'm literally me. What feeling do you get from like performing as well? It's a 30 minute set, feels like two minutes. I, I, like I'm always like, you know, wow, like I'm, it's the last song already. Oh, at the end of the day, people want to listen to your music and connect with you on a human level. Still just a normal person. I come from a council estate, you know, it's just, it's just who I am. And after that, it's just, you know, be yourself. This next song is about being in love. Has anybody here ever been in love? Guess that's love if it fucks you up, if it fucks you up, if it fucks you up. Guess that's love if it fucks you up, if it fucks you up.
tried my best, but I guess that's love. If it fucks you up. Thank you very much.